guys, this is Mike Mozart back again, bringing the coolest products of yesterday and today. And anybody that's watched the news in the last few days knows about the Fisher Price Little Mommy Cuddle and Coo doll. Um, I bought this sample about two months ago. This this product's been out for quite a while. Not only was it out for a while, I've actually scavenged parts from the packaging because I, I use all my samples to create new toys. And there's been a lot of controversy that this doll says an Islamic phrase. Supposedly, this little doll says, Islam is the light. That's all it says. You know me, I'd be the first one to jump on something if I thought it was really bad. I mean, it's not like po. It's not like this po. I mean, that's that's very distinctive, and that was picked up on immediately when the toys hit the shelves. That little cuddle and coo doll has been out there for months. And that's something that you don't pick up to try like Poe. You walked by those and they went off. You could hear them when you walked by. No one else picked up on it. I had it in my possession for months. I never noticed it. I pulled it out two weeks ago before the controversy so I could salvage that little bottle off of it for a different project. And I listened to it. I didn't notice anything. I've tried it with dead batteries, half dead batteries, every level of battery that there is. Now I'm going to play it right now as a loop so that you can hear it. And if you look right down there, you're going to say a hype-o-meter. With one being, this is ridiculous, there's nothing wrong with this doll. To ten being, oh yeah, there's something going on here that's serious. Um, put that in the comment section right down there. Is this all hype or do you really think there's something to this? Hey, and if you liked my review of the Cuddle and Coo controversy, please give me five stars. How about it, baby? I'd really appreciate those five stars. Oh, don't forget to push that blue button down there. It says Jeepers Media. You'll be glad you did. I really review the controversial, bizarre, and unusual toys, and I think I'll have a lot of fun looking at them. Oh, don't forget to push that subscribe button down there. Oh, you'll be glad you did. I have hundreds of toys that I'm going to be reviewing, and some more controversial than even this one. Hey, thanks again. Thank you.